Mi pak is a noodle dish with Chinese noodle characterized by its flat and yellow appearance, varying in thickness and width. The dish is of Teochew origin and is commonly served in a number of countries such as Chaoshan, China, Singapore, Malaysia and Thailand. Mi pak is commonly served tossed in a sauce often referred to as dry or ta in Hokkien pei, hog, ta, though sometimes served in a soup where it is referred to as soup or turn. Meat and vegetables are added on top. Mi pak can be categorized into two variants, fish ball mi pak, yuan mi pak and mushroom minced meat mi pak bak chor mi. Bak chor mi is usually exclusively prepared using thin noodles, mi kia, while yuan mi can be cooked with other noodle varieties. Mi pak is a staple commonly offered in hawker centers and coffee shops in Singapore, together with other Chinese noodle dishes. Mi pak sauce The sauce in which the noodles are tossed in is a very important aspect of the dish, and is considered a representation of the cook's skill and experience. The importance of the sauce in mi pak can be thought of similarly as the sauces that accompany pasta. The sauce consists of four components, chili, oil, vinegar and other condiments such as soy sauce and pepper. The chili is made from various ingredients and its preparation often includes frying and blending. Oil, traditionally lard, ensures a smooth texture in the noodles, although vegetable oil is sometimes used as a healthier though less tasty version. Vinegar is added for its sourness, and diners may specify how much vinegar is used. The chili sauce may be replaced with tomato ketchup for children, who are uncomfortable with the spiciness of the chili. Soup Soup is served in a bowl as a side dish accompanying the dry variant, or served together with the noodles for the soup version where the sauce is omitted. Traditionally, the soup is boiled and simmered overnight with old hen, pork bones, dried sole fish and soybean. The resulting broth is rich in taste and cloudy in appearance. Topic. Mi pak noodles Usually, the noodles are factory made, and require substantial preparation before cooking. Different hawkers prepare and cook their noodles differently, but the desired outcome is the same, springy al dente noodles. Hawkers often toss the noodles vigorously to remove excess flour and soda and to separate noodles which have stuck together. Other processes include stretching the noodles, cutting into a desired length, and separating into serving portions. The cooking process of the noodles consists of blanching in hot and cold water multiple times, though some hawkers omit the cold water. The noodles are drained and placed in either sauce or broth. Bak chor mi Bak chor mi, which translates to minced meat noodles, is a Singaporean noodle dish popularly sold as street food in hawker centers and food courts. The noodles are tossed in vinegar, minced meat, pork slices, pork liver, stewed sliced mushrooms, meat balls and bits of deep fried lard. Bak chor mi can be categorized into two variants, dry and soup version. Most dry versions come with slices of stewed mushroom, minced pork, slices of lean pork and sometimes, fried econ bilis, atop noodles tossed in a punchy chili vinegar sauce, while soup versions are lauded for the depth of pork flavor in its broth. Singapore's bak chor mee listed as Tops World Street Food by World Street Food Congress. <laughs> Fish ball mee pak This version of mi pak is usually served with toppings of fish balls, sliced fish cakes, geo a type of small dumpling made with fish meat paste wrapping a small bit of minced meat, minced meat, meat balls, lettuce or tauga bean sprouts in Hokkien. Requests can be made to add or omit any of the above toppings, to prepare it in soup or dry style, and with or without the chili sauce. Other types of toppings Newer varieties of toppings include deep-fried dumplings, abalone slices, imitation crab stick, and other processed fish products.
Topic: In popular culture. Me Pak Man is the title of a film directed by Eric Ku, a Singaporean film director. Back Chor Me featured prominently in an episode of The Mr. Brown Show, which satirized the James Gomez saga during the 2006 Singapore general elections. See also Chinese noodles <laughs>